Greetings, this is Brent Maxwell, meteorologist with the National Weather Service in San Diego, California, with the weekly weather outlook. Overall, temperatures are going to be a little bit above normal, though the deserts could be as much as about 10 degrees above normal, while generally near the coast it'll be near or even just a little bit below normal. There will be occasional gusty west winds in the mountains and deserts, with strongest winds definitely this afternoon and tonight. There will be areas of night and morning coastal low clouds and fog. Of course, that generally becomes more prevalent as we go through April. And the same thing with the precipitation. No precipitation is expected through early next week, and of course that becomes a more common feature through April as the rainy season has mostly ended. Here is the big picture. We have high pressure aloft generally off the coast of Southern California and points farther south. This map is actually for this coming Friday, but it sort of shows an average state of the atmosphere for the rest of this week. Note that the storm track will stay well turned north this week and so any trough of low pressure that hits the Pacific Northwest and Southwest Canada, that will just continue going off to the east. And of course the precipitation for the next week, this ensemble model average is showing zero in California and really all of the rest of the Southwest as well. So it's definitely going to stay dry for a while. If we look at the maximum temperatures, on Tuesday they'll be a little bit cooler than we've been for the past few days. Highs will only be in the lower to mid 90s in the lower deserts. This is in contrast with this past weekend where both Saturday and Sunday, Ocotillo Wells in far eastern San Diego County hit 103. And not only was that the hottest spot of the country both days, but also the hottest spot in the U.S. so far in 2021. Note that near the coast, some of the beaches will only be in the 60s. For Wednesday, we'll have a slight warm-up. We'll have some 80s returning in some of the valleys, especially the Inland Empire, and we'll have mostly mid-90s in the lower deserts. And starting with Thursday and continuing through next weekend, there will only be minor day-to-day -day temperature changes. If you're out in the mountains and deserts today, it is quite windy out there. We have some gusts around 60 miles per hour, and that will continue through the rest of this afternoon and tonight, especially from the mountain crests, through the desert slopes, and in places like San Gregorio Pass, which is where I-10 goes through northwest of Palm Springs. But the rest of the week will have somewhat lighter winds. I'm showing an example from Wednesday, which is pretty typical of what the rest of the week will be like. There'll be some gusty winds, of course, in places like the San Gregorio Pass and on the desert slopes in San Diego County. But for the most part, the strong gusts will be around 40 miles per hour, not 60. Hope you can enjoy the weather for the rest of this week and take care and hope you can all stay safe.